today's Health Watch. Obstructive sleep apnea, or OSA, affects almost 18 million Americans. Local 5's Caitlin Corbett met a Northeast Wisconsin patient who sleeps just fine without masks or machines. Traditional sleep apnea masks and machines can be disruptive to daily life. Paul Rubeski had had enough. That's when he found a hassle-free solution at Aurora Bay Care Medical Center. Well, in uh, May of 2017, I had a uh, heart attack in California, and they told me at that point in time that uh, I definitely had some breathing problems and that I would have to wear a CPAP machine. Paul Rubeski is a traveler. He's always had issues with snoring at night, but he didn't know just how much his lifestyle was about to change after an official diagnosis with sleep apnea. So an individual has sleep apnea when they go to sleep, the muscle tone in their upper airway decreases too much. And it allows the upper airway, think about it as kind of a tube, to become more collapsible and to narrow or completely close when they're sleeping at night. Dr. Robert Sonnenberg is an ENT physician at Aurora Bay Care. He says Rubeski had many of the symptoms associated with sleep apnea, loud snoring, drowsiness, pauses in breathing during sleep. Rubeski tried the most common two masked options to treat sleep apnea, a CPAP machine and later a BiPAP machine. He found that both hindered his active lifestyle. It was very difficult because even the airline sometimes wouldn't let me take three pieces of luggage on. I'd have my roller board, I'd have my briefcase, and I would have a medical device. But I could not get used to the CPAP machine. Like the doctor said, it has positive pressure almost continuously and doesn't slow down during your exhale. That's when in 2023, Rubeski sought the help of Aurora Bay Care and Dr. Sonnenberg to explore more comfortable and suitable options. Here, Rubeski discovered a surgical option, the Inspire Sleep Apnea Implant. So the implant is, it's, there's a generator. It looks kind of like a pacemaker sized device that's implanted in the right upper chest. It senses their breathing pattern and then it sends a series of mild stimulations to the nerve to move the tongue forward and open the airway from front to back. No bulky travel cases, no cleaning, no masks. And even better, his wife Holly can sleep peacefully too. Rubeski had found the solution he had been looking for. Now all he needs is a remote control to turn it on and get back to his life. So the Inspire just allows you that flexibility to sleep where you want. It's very quiet. Even if I take a nap, Holly can come by and turn the machine on or off. And it's just a, that simple and that she can do that and doesn't have to hook up the thing and look like I'm a, you know, Darth Vader sleeping next to her. Sleep apnea can manifest in many different ways. Contact your primary care physician if you think you may suffer from sleep apnea. And that's your Health Watch for Local 5 News. I'm Caitlin Corbett.